Homes have destroyed her clothing, furniture, and most everything inside her rental home. But a Monroe woman says the smell is even worse. So bad and so foul that it's giving her children and her headaches. She has called us for action after learning the trouble's mold. NBC 10's Bria Jones has been talking to the house, has been at the house, talking to the property owners and some old analysts over at ULM. How bad is this, Bria? Well, Gordon and Natasha, that tenant says the ongoing mold problem has caused her not only to lose nearly all of her furniture, but forcing her out of her home just before the holiday season. The last of her furniture, now in her driveway, dirty, damaged, and covered in mold. Ebony Alexis Joseph is living her worst nightmare. I'm losing out of thousands here because I had like everything is gone. Basically, living room set, bedroom set, bathroom set, everything. Joseph says after living in this home nearly two years, when her children started getting sick and she discovered this mold on the back of their furniture, that's when she knew there was a bigger issue. My children keep having fevers out the blue, headaches, they keep throwing up, getting sick, and, you know, I have had heart problems. She found mold mice crawling on her TV and started asking questions. And when the villages of Standifer told her it was an act of nature, that's when her mother took samples to ULM's asbestos and mold laboratory. I think there were four or five different uh, varieties of mold found on the samples. John Harrop, an instructor at the ULM lab, says whenever there is mold, it means there is moisture. It's either humidity in the house, a water drip, a leak, Something is giving the mold moisture. Joseph now left in limbo as she waits and hopes management will correct the issue and hopefully replace her furniture and refund some of her money. I don't see any changes at all because I still see mold and everything on the baseboards. I want them to at least give me the value of my stuff. I'm not asking for new, you know, just the value so I can put that towards something else. I reached out to JM Management, the owners of that property. They say all protocol and procedures have been followed. As of today, they say they will send another cleaning crew over to the home. In the studio, Bria Jones, NBC 10, your local news leader. Another reason for the importance of rental insurance. We thank you, Bria.